a designer. In this video, we will see liquid fill that basically is a, a blender add-on that allow you to easy fill any object with liquid by defining its uh, recipient. So let's get started. So as you can see, you need to install uh, the liquid fill blender add-on. And uh, after you install, you will see with uh, the panel on the on your right with a fill active. Uh, shade active and uh, recipients. So let's see a recipient, for example, American paint glass. Uh, add the asset to 3D courses to add the object. This is, you can see, here is uh, the object. So we need a shade active to activate uh, basically the glass that uh, we want to make. This is th this is a uh, Uber glass that you can basically give uh, different parameters like patterns and many more and there are also uh, shaders that you can apply to so to the liquid so you need to make fill active and uh, let's see render view so as you can see it works perfectly to work perfectly it needs a thickness on the top part particularly an open up and uh, finally, a single mesh island, so you can't have uh, more than one. So as you can see, here a uh, single mesh mesh island. So let's create a um, a plane with uh, an ambient, so we can make uh, the glass uh, looks better. So as you can see, here is an ambient. Let's add the uh, sky texture. Go into shading tab. Then uh, on the word, we add uh, um, another background by sh duplicate sheet D and add a mixed shader. And uh, as factor, we use the uh, is camera array. So basically, we can see the HDRI. So as you can see, here is the liquid with uh, recipient, that is glass with lights. So with the shader, basically we can set at 0 0.25. And we can also change the liquid. So before, before in, we need to activate uh, a shader. There, there are many different uh, uh, material shader with a different liquid. So for example, cranberry juice, so it's loaded. You can add more bubbles, foam center, foam amount. You can hide the recipients to see only the liquids, or you can also hide the liquids to see only the recipients. For some sort of liquid, they are less uh, visible than other. So let's see in the uh, render view. So basically, as, as you can see, basically it keeps uh, the all the all the factor about physics. So if uh, if we change the position, it keeps uh, and calculate all the fluid dynamics. So as you can see, the liquid goes in this di direction. So basically, go until in this direction compared to before that is on this direction. So basically, if you want to test an object, you need a thickness that uh, you can add with a solidify modifier and an opening up with um, the part on the top and a single mesh island. So we can add also, basically we can add also um, uh, ca caustic modifi uh, caustics and uh, refractive. So to enable, we need to, we need to go to the object. On, on the object panel, you need to scroll down until you find Shading tab, cast uh, shadow and uh, receives shadow. And uh, now, if you can test it, it doesn't work because we need to apply also to the plane. 
but only with uh, received shadow, a light, particularly a point light. And we put uh, here the ground. And then uh, we need to add also on the uh, render tab. We need to add uh, light paths, direct light, uh, refracting and reflecting, and 0 0.1 as the filter glossy. You know the shading on the plane. So as you can see now, there is a sort of uh, refractic and caustics. Caustics. So basically we can down the second light. Like one. And uh, as you can see, basically there is a little refraction. We can also transform into an area light. So basically, as you can see, you can change also the liquids, like for example, Blue Lagoon. So let's add another recipient, for example, Liquifil Carafe. Add the two 3D cursor. Add the shader. Feel active. Then the shader active. As you can see, there is uh, the water. We can enable uh, caustics, shadow, and receive. As you can see, there is a, a little refraction here, and also here. And uh, we can also make uh, our own model. So let's make, for example, uh, a cube. Scale down. We remove the top part in the edit mode, so the edit face. Then we need to add um, a solidify modifier to add the thickness, like this. Apply. We can also add the bevel. Zero point zero one, and apply to. Then uh, we need to fill active. So it works. And the shader to the recipient. And also to the liquid. And then uh, liquid amount, we can make also 80. And we can do the same thing by adding to the object tab, cast and receive. And then uh, as material we can change to something different, like chocolate milk. And let's see the result. So basically you can animate the liquid. Basically, with uh, location selector, you can add uh, the keyframe. As you can see, it's uh, the minimum part. You can also add the liquid or add the recipient to see the animation. And uh, it keeps the shape. So basically, if you don't bake, it lose uh, all its uh, dynamics and calculation. So let's see this scene now. So as you can see, I apply the caustics with the uh, geometry. Cast shadow, receives shadow, and receive shadow. And also in the render tab, 
in the render tab on light paths reflecting and uh, reflecting on and in your right light then can so basically now we will create a UV sphere and remove the top faces then we need to add uh, basically basically we need to add the uh, uh, solidify modifier for the added tickets and apply then we can uh, experiment with tc or dom that allow you to make uh, organic design that is free inside the blender dual mesh by selecting sphere and then select both and then tessellate as you can see there is an uh, organic shape then uh, remove a dual mesh and uh, tessellation and then we select uh, the sphere and then we go to liquid field fill active now it works we make uh, 80% and then we add the uh, shader to both uh, recipient and a little bit then we change the material to something like uh, iced tea then we disable the sphere and we add we need to add the tessellation and on the sphere hide the recipient so you can see only the liquid and maybe we can make um, a shader glass in the tessellation So, so basically, as you can see, there is all, all the part. Maybe we can try with um, different shader. Not for the liquid, maybe lemonade. So let's see how it goes with the viewport. It reflects the lemonade. You can also disable the selection and see how it goes with sphere. So as you can see, it works well also with uh, this shader. So hope the video is helpful. As you can see, there is uh, the link in the description if you want to learn more about it. And there is also the commission inside and uh, see you soon.